Hello! Sim the World back with the latest series playing PC Building Simulator, the eSports expansion. Come join us as we fix some computers, replace some graphics cards, and get our eSports team ready to win it all. In the last video, we met some of our team members, our manager, and our sponsor. After fixing up our first PC, we already had a mountain of work to do. Let's get back to the action. All right, so let's check our emails and see where we left off. We've got a lot of clutter in here. So let's go ahead and get rid of anything we don't need anymore. Don't need anything from uncle. This PC's still here. We got to replace the PSU. This PC's on our way. Same with this one. And yes, we're reminded of the match this weekend. All right, so we've got to take care of replacing this PSU. We still have the power supply in the cart, and this actually has to get done today. So we're going to do same day delivery on this so we can get this job taken care of. Ah, that must be the part now. So with our PSU, we're gonna come over and we'll go to install. Sell the broken one, because we don't need that anymore. Hopefully none of you guys buy that on eBay someday. And it runs. Let's go ahead and put the side panel on. And we are done. We're going to place this in the delivery area. Come back over here. And we'll collect our money. Now we only made 150 bucks from that. So with the new part and the rush delivery, we kind of lost 20 bucks. It's all right. We're going to make more money in the future. So with that, we are waiting on the next two parts. Um, Let's go ahead and call it a day. So now with our two new computers, let's go ahead, throw this on the workbench. So this is Tucker's computer. He's saying it's not working right. We suspected it was some viruses, but in fact, you get a no CPU found error. We also see the CPU fan cooler is not spinning. So it looks like both of those need to be replaced. We need one fan and we need a Celeron G3900. Let's go ahead and throw those in the cart. Get a CPU. We actually want search for the cheap here we are there's our CPU and conveniently the cheapest cooler that was easy let's go ahead and check out the other computer this is uh, the one Grash wanted us to fix we need to upgrade the graphics card we need to upgrade it so it can play hard as stone I don't know about you guys. I don't know what graphics card Heart of Stone needs to run. Let's check out the Will It Run program. Come over here, search for Heart of Stone. We see it needs an AMD Radeon R937 2 gig version. So if we come over to the shop, let's throw one of those in the shopping cart. And the cheapest version we have is with MSI. Throw that in the cart. Let's also check our emails. So Grash is thanking us for fixing her brother's computer. And then we have another one. This is a new one. Hi, 
Sorry, just remembered one other thing you could do to make my little brother's PC even better. He really loves how eSport rigs always have cool lighting, doesn't know how to set it up. Can you make the fans light up the hardest stone colors? Like one blue fan and one orange fan? You would be so happy. So we want to take this job. And for that we're going to need two fans that can, we can program the colors. Let's come back to the shop. We want to grab case fans. Let's find the cheapest RGB fans possible and add two of those to our cart. With that, we're going to get those delivered. And let's go ahead and end the day. Oh, before we do that, let's see if Crash wants to get a hold of us. She does not. She's content. Nobody's liking us. And we've not had any matches. So that let's end our day. We're going to go to work. We've got our new parts. We've got our little brother's computer. Throw that up there. We get the side panels off. Oh, it looks like there's already two RGB fans in there. Conveniently, it tells us which colors we need to program them. So for that, let's throw in one of our USB sticks. That way we can install some lighting options. We will restart the PC. This is taking a minute. All right, let's jump in. So we need one fan set to 250, 147, 29. Let's go ahead and set that to 250, 147, 29. Apply that. And for the other fan, we need to set it to 4, 237, 216. So that's 4, 237, 216. And with that, our lights are set. Look at that. So I don't think we need the lighting software on here anymore. The lights are already set. Let's put the side panel back on. and place this in the delivery area. Your little brother should be happy with that. Let's also get that graphics card in real quick. So this is for Grash's old computer. Let's throw in the graphics card. And with all the cables installed, We have upgraded, meets minimum spec, with the side panel, oh, we need the PCI lock on, and the side panel. This computer is ready to go as well. All right, we're just cruising through these jobs today. Finally, Mr. Manager, get rid of that broken part, put in the new CPU, mustn't forget the thermal paste. Too bad in this game we can't glob it on, unlike some other tutorial videos. Looking at you, The Verge. And let's get the CPU cooler on. I'm going to use the correct parts. Make sure it boots. While it's booting, we can put the side panel on. This job is done as well. All right go collect us some money so you are taking care of Grash get rid of that 
Ah, Mr. Tucker. Send us money as well, thank you. And Grash's brother. You now have a lit PC. Oh, Pop Corsair. Hi. We have one last request we'd like you to make before the match tomorrow. It's very important that Corsair is strongly represented on stage. Not just in great performance, but in style too. A rainbow color scheme would really get people's attention, don't you think? Get at least two components shining bright in the rainbow color mode and we'll be happy. Can't wait to see the results. All right, sounds like Papa Corsair wants us to get some RGB going on. Luckily we got those fans. Looks like those are already in RGB fan mode. Um, let's go ahead and just confirm that by installing the lighting service. And make sure those two fans are in rainbow mode. Let's crank up that speed, give some people some seizures. All right. They should be happy with that tonight. Oh yeah, that looks great. That should make them happy. There you go. We have two components shining bright. Oh boy, that hurts my eyes. All right, let's get that out of here. And with that, I believe we're ready to end the day. So now let's end the day. Let's check the phone real quick. Again, no one wants us for anything. So away we shall go. Let's end our day. All right, take a deep breath, it's match day. This is your backstage workspace, where you can make any last minute tweaks to players' machines. The stage doors will open soon. When you're ready, carry Grash's computer on stage and set it up. You're working to a strict time limit, so keep an eye on the countdown. If Grash's PC doesn't work, or if you don't set it up right, she won't be happy and her performance will suffer. If you finish before the timer ends, press F to skip to start the match. All right, let's see. What's up? Hi again, looking forward to the game today. Just wondered if you could make a quick change for me. I was hoping to record how I play so I can study it up after the match, but I'm running out of hard drive space and don't know if I'll have enough to record the whole game. Can you add more space for me? At least two terabytes of storage should be enough. Thanks. Well, I don't think I have any storage space on me. Go ahead and grab this PC. And we need two terabytes. So let's go ahead. And do we have a computer to order off of? Yes, we do. They're thanking us, thanking us. All right, let's go ahead and grab us some two terabytes of storage. Let's filter this from cheapest to most expensive. One terabyte and two terabytes. Add to cart. And we need same day, same day deliveries, $200. Jesus. Well, what we get for last minute ins installations. Let's go ahead and put the storage in. The cables are on. Let's get the side panels on. Make sure it can boot. Oh, that it can. And it is bright. So let's go get this set up on stage. Ah, no one's here, that makes sense. We need to boot this up. 
and we are set up and ready to go. All right, oh, the stage looks pretty cool. All right, I think we are finished. Yep, everyone should be happy for the match. Let's get it started. Match is in progress. Wonder who's going to win. The results are... Ah, the Vandals won. Oh, my phone is blowing up like crazy. Let's go ahead and check out. We have 12 likes on LinkedIn. I know you're just getting settled in, but there's an opening on Fort Fight Duo's team. We thought you might be appreciate the opportunity. Twice the players means twice the workload, but hopefully you're up to the speed again now. So what do you say? All right, let's take the second player. Also got to check out those texts we just got. Boy, that phone is blowing up. So we got Grash here. Gave us four out of four thumbs up. You should check your LinkedIn app. You'll start getting job offers from other teams now that you've got some experience. Not that I want you to go, but... Ah, oh, Grash sent you a gift. Hey, not sure if you got my gift yet. I told them to leave it in your workshop. On one of those shelves as you go in. Thanks again for coming back and helping out last week. And good luck with your new team. Well, we're done with Grash. We have our new team member, MG. Looking forward to working together. We shall give her also the sunglasses. Not sure what the eyeballs mean. Further, we have Picard texting us. He says, hey, hey, welcome aboard. You were on the Heart of Stone last season, right? Glad you stuck with us. Vandals isn't a perfect company, but we've got what it takes to win. I should know. We've got me. Oh, wow. Let's send him. Well, since the other girl sent us eyes, maybe this is a theme. Huh. He sent us sunglasses back. Very interesting. Papa Corsair. Two out of two thumbs. Likes our fans, apparently. We got them covered. They're sending us eyes, too. And finally, the Vandals. They sent us six out of six thumbs. So a lot of that feedback must just have been the ratings on Liked In. All right. So we got that taken care of. We have a new banner there. And we have our gift, little Heart of Stones League trophy. Cool. And with that, thanks for watching as I simulate my life one game at a time. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit the subscribe so you don't miss any of the future action. You can follow on Twitter for updates to future games being played, as well as follow on Twitch as I try to stream three days a week. Thanks, and I'll see you next time at Sim the World.